What's up guys, Jared back once again, and so we've got Paranoid Android uh, version 4.0 beta running on our Samsung Galaxy S4, and this is in fact the Android 4.4.2 KitKat variant, um, and when I say beta, it really should be alpha, and we'll get into that in just a moment, um, but right from the home screen here, you'll notice that it is in fact just like the Nexus 5 launcher, um, so you know, swiping to the right uh, gives us access to our Google Now cards and all that good stuff, obviously I don't have my um, Google Google account synced up at the moment. Uh, jump into the application tray here. There really isn't anything other than the Paranoid Android over the air application. Now, I haven't flashed Paranoid Android on any of my devices for quite some time now. So I don't know if this is something that's been available for several months. For all I know, I've got a lot of devices and I flash a lot of different ROMs. So, uh, but for those of you that are unfamiliar with uh, Paranoid Android, this is the application that they provide you to stay up to date on all of their um, ROM updates instead of having to download it and manually push it over to your device which is always really, really convenient. Um, now, let's go ahead and pull down the notification tray and actually switch on over to the quick tile settings here. And, you know, everything's here as you would expect. Um, immersive mode, you do have access to that. But you'll notice another little button uh, up there in the right-hand corner. And actually, if we click on that, that actually allows us to start editing um, the placement of our tiles. So, actually, if we can go ahead and do that again. Oh, that didn't work. Let's try this again. There we go. So you can start, you know, start rearranging things as you see fit. And I like the little animations of things slide around. And then of course, you're gonna lock everything back into place by clicking it again, and away you go. Uh, jumping into the settings menu, and this is actually where I was um, talking about the whole, you know, it's called a beta, but in my uh, opinion, personal opinion, of course, uh, it should really be called an alpha. Of course, it is working. Um, but a lot of alpha builds work as well for ROMs, and you'll notice here that with um, Paranoid Android, even more specifically, there's a huge section they usually have for customizations, and um, we just don't have that at all in the menu here. Now, um, obviously, progress and you know customization availability will vary from device to device, and obviously, the Samsung Galaxy S4 is not going to be the only and last device that they um, create Paranoid Android for. It's obviously for tons of different devices out there. So, um, you know, if you have a Nexus 5 and you manage to fly it or whatever the device you have, um, you know, you might have some different options in here. But for the Samsung Galaxy S4, this is what we're limited to at the moment. Literally um, nothing but uh, just a few button configurations here. Um, let's go ahead and jump down to About Phone just so you guys can get a look for yourself. This is currently available for the AT&T Samsung Galaxy S4, the Canadian, all Canadian variant uh, Galaxy S4s, as well as the T-Mobile Galaxy S4. So you can see here, Build 4.0, it is based off of Android 4.4.2. Um, and that is it. <laughs> um, anyways, guys, hopefully you like this video. I'll be posting a link in the description below um, so you can go and check it out and download it for your uh, specific variant of Galaxy S4. But that is it for this one. Hopefully you did like it. If you did, did like the video, click that likes button down below. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe for more videos in the future. But that's it. We'll see you in the next one, guys. Thanks for watching. Cheers.